Now let me show you guys how to install the carburetor on your engine. Now you have to plug one end, and for now this is the only connection we'll make, we'll plug the one end into the intake manifold on our engine. So first of all, find the intake manifold on your engine, and make sure you have a hose clamp, and get this as loose as possible. There we go, we have a little play in there. So whenever you're looking at your carburetor, the part that you want to plug into the engine is the area that releases the fuel-air mixture. Now in a lot of carburetors, this looks the same as the area where the air is coming into your carburetor. So how can you tell the difference? Well, an easy way where you can tell the difference is if you look where your throttle is, where the throttle cable is going to go, you see that little door right there? This is the area that goes into the engine. Now, also on a lot of carburetors, the hoses are different sizes, so this is the only size that's going to fit in. But, uh, you know, that's also another way to tell. So go ahead and carefully slide this into the intake manifold in your engine. You actually want to be really careful anytime you're working with carburetors in general. But now that it's slid in place, make sure it's all the way tight in there and tighten it up. There we go. Looks nice and tight. So now I want to mention a couple things because we don't have the other systems such as the gas tank and the air filter hooked up to our engine yet. But whenever we do, remember to connect everything you need to to the carburetor. For example, whenever we hook up the uh, fuel tank, this is where, this is the hose that's going to connect to the fuel tank and also runs into the carburetor. Um, whenever we hook up our gas pedal and throttle cable, remember to hook it up on this side. Whenever we hook up our air filter, this is where the air filter is going to go. And these extra hoses are for something called the PCB system, and I'll talk about that later. But just remember that that is the basics of what a carburetor is and how you install it on your engine. But just remember you're not done working with it. You have to hook up the other things. And whenever I put those systems in, I'll show you guys how to do that. But for now, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next video.